Hi, I am Rainbow Felding Ding, and I will tell you how our Mother Earth behaves when she is under stress or how the land that we are standing on behaves when it experiences earthquakes. Tensional stress causes rocks to be pulled apart that result to lengthening and break apart. This type of stress can be found at divergent plate boundaries. Tensional stress is one type of stress that describes the movement of plates around fault lines. Tensional stress happens when pieces of rock are pulled apart. This happens when two plates shift farther away from each other or when one plate end is moving in a different direction than another end. Compressional stress causes rocks to fold or fracture. It squeezes rocks together. Compression is the most common type of stress in convergent plate boundaries. Compressional stress is when a rock is pressed together and to itself, like when cross movements cause two rocks to squeeze another one between them. Another example is when mountains are formed at a convergent boundary, like the Rocky Mountains. Shear stress happens when forces slide past each other in opposite direction, which results to slippage and translation. This is the most common stress found in transform plate boundaries. Shear stress, force tending to cause deformation of a material by slippage along a plane or planes parallel to the imposed stress. The resultant shear is of great importance in nature, being intimately related to the downslope movement of earth materials and to earthquakes. Geological structures are usually the result of the powerful tectonic forces that occur within the Earth. There are two main types of geological structures, namely the folds and the faults. Folds are formed when rocks experience compressive stress and deform plastically. It is the bending of rocks, and there are three types of folds, namely the monocline, anticline, and the syncline. A monocline is a simple bend in the rock layers where the oldest rocks are at the bottom and the youngest are at the top. An anticline is a fold that arches upward where the oldest rocks are found at the center of the anticline. The youngest rocks are covered over them at the top of the structure. A syncline is a fold that bends downwards where rocks are curved down to a center. The second type of geological structure is the fold. Folds are rock under ample stress that will crack or fracture. The fracture is called a joint because there is a block of rock left standing on either side of a fault line. The rock on top of the fault is called the foot wall, and the one below is called the hanging wall. As can be seen in the image, the one above is called the hanging wall and the one below is called the foot wall. Once again, I am Rainbow Felding Ding and I hope this video helped. If you like the video, please press the like button and please click the subscribe button to support our YouTube channel.